In daily life, the terms mass and weight are often used interchangeably. For students of science, however, it's crucial to understand the difference. We associate mass and weight with the measurement of how heavy an object is. While this can be a fundamental explanation, there are many details involved. This video talks about mass and weight and the key differences between them. What is mass? Every object in this universe is made of matter, which in turn is made of subatomic particles like electrons, protons, and neutrons. One of the basic properties of matter is that it has a mass. Mass is one of the fundamental quantities in physics, and it is defined as the amount of matter in a particular body. The International Standard Unit of Mass, or the SI unit, is the kilogram, kilogram. It is crucial to remember that the mass of a body remains constant at all times. However, in certain rare cases like a nuclear reaction, some amount of mass is converted into energy. Therefore, the mass of the substance reduces. What is weight? Weight is also one of the fundamental quantities in physics. The definition of weight in chemistry is the amount of gravitational force acting on it. Since weight is a measure of force, the SI unit of weight is Newton. To find out the weight of a body, we multiple its mass with acceleration due to gravity. Hence, the formula comes out to be W equals mg. Now, in this instant equation, the mass of the body remains constant but the acceleration due to gravity is variable because it can change from place to place. When you stand at the North Pole, you experience more weight than a person standing at the equator. The mass of both people here remains the same but acceleration due to gravity changes. Conclusion mass is one of the basic properties of matter. The SI unit of mass is the kilogram, kilogram. The mass of a body remains constant at all times. Weight is the measurement of the amount of gravitational force acting on a body. The SI unit of weight is N, Newton. The weight of a body depends on the location as the acceleration due to gravity is inversely proportional to the square of the distance between two objects.